Wish we had some music. We had some music. You're not allowed to have music. You know that. None? No. All right, we're live. What is up, everyone? Oh, man. If I wish you guys could see. Look, there's no viewers on. I guess we're waiting for the... Uh... Hold up. Let me check. Oh, here they come. <laughs> we're, we are late. We, we're late. So I'm sorry that we're late. There we go. Everyone's coming. Here they come. There we They're go. They're flying in. All right. What is up, guys? Man, I wish you guys could see the tension and stress levels. <laughs> Golly, look at how many people jumped on so quick. Awesome. Uh, yes. But, please, please do tell us where you're where you're watching hold, hold in on, from. You're jumping Sorry, ahead. I'm just. I saw David say hello from Long Beach. So oh, I figured I'd jump the gun. The, the <laughs> tension and stress levels before live feeds. You guys, it, this whole place turns into a complete like wire fest and we're like sound checking we're making sure everything's right getting our scenes right it's it's completely stressful <sighs> but like just a second ago <laughs> just a second ago was like just take a deep breath take a deep breath like oh man but we're live we made it we're a little bit late sorry for being late so you know how we start off guys tell us where you're from where you're watching from um yeah this is going to be a good show. I'm super excited. We got a whole bunch of cool stuff to talk about. A whole bunch of great announcements. We're doing the, the Patreon giveaways. It's going to be a, a fun show. I was super excited about this one. I'm also excited because I'm off tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So I like I don't have to like Lucky. stress out about that. I was working up a little late today, but... He <sighs> says, quit drinking so much coffee before you go live. I know, right? <laughs> I, honestly, I, I do it because it, it picks me up, you know? But I yeah. saw a lot of people on the on the group. So Melissa, you guys can see Melissa up there. Um, actually, you know what? Dang it! I need to lower you down because the live. I think the live ticker. Are you watching it live? Yeah, I don't see the okay. live ticker <laughs> on mine. It looks like on uh, Monsters Inc. You know how the the icon goes right in front of uh, <laughs> Mike Mike Wazowski's face yeah. on my view. The live ticker where it tells the time is right over your face, so you can't even see your face. <laughs> okay. Um, but dang, already 100 people on. That's awesome. Um, we got Again, we got a lot to talk about. That new Losi truck released today. I was, It's right here. Um, I'm, I wasn't... Like, all those reactions were genuine. Um, it's probably one of the most... I would say most well-built RTRs I've seen in a long time. Like, it's all metal. It is... It's, it's freaking incredible. I, I think it's awesome. Uh, so much so, I already told Melissa. What's here? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just waiting. Oh my gosh, so... <laughs> <laughs> Melissa's actually sitting to the right of me here. Um, but she's like staring at the camera. <laughs> so I'm sitting there staring at her and this is what I uh, see. Oh, there goes Paul! Paul! Already starting off with yeah, the... Oh yeah. Kick it off. Awesome job with the digger day. Hey, thanks a lot, I know. Paul. That was exciting. I could. When he says it, oh, oh dyslexic, dyslexic, dyslexic dog, dog is dog. here. But yeah. Um, it says time to break the seal. Yeah, that digger, yeah. the digger video was cool. Uh, yeah, if you guys didn't know the little super chat, that is greatly appreciated. Uh, if you're commenting, we don't see it. We I mean, we do see it, but they just go so fast They go fast super sometimes. fast. Yeah, and I'm not a very fast reader, so I try to keep up. But. but in regards to what... So this is what I see. We'll see if I can demonstrate what I see on the camera. Whenever I'm looking at Melissa, this is what I see. <laughs> <laughs> well, what else am I supposed to do? I mean, like... Oh, man, it's so funny. It's like, I'm right here. Why are you looking over there? <laughs> well, because I'm supposed to be looking at y'all. Oh, man, that is too funny. All right, guys from Canada, awesome. Who gonna else pre-order and not gonna tell my wife. Jordan's RC, hey, dude, that truck is legit. And I'm not gonna lie, anything licensed, I feel like you should probably jump on. Um, yeah, God, I, I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, I know when he was recording it, I could hear him downstairs. He would not tell me. He seriously is a tight-lipped mofo. Like he was not saying a word. I but I could hear him. He was like, oh, like I could hear him, like get excited. So. <laughs> I yeah. pissed Peter off last night. Uh, if you guys, uh, Peter's been on the vlog a couple of times. He's a good friend of mine. He's like, "What's the car?" I was like, "I can't tell you, man." He's like, "Seriously?" I'm like, "I'm serious." And he was, I, I could tell he was really irritated with me last <laughs> night. Uh, but I, I couldn't tell anybody. But you know what? I'm honored. Uh, you know, I so okay. So I got to talk about why I released. I released an hour late. Um, 
There's a reason why I released an hour late. You didn't miss anything, Brandon. We're just jumping right in. He's like, hey, guys. Yeah, we just started. From Plano. What's up, Gavin from Plano? That's really close. Um, So there's a reason why I released really late. So I actually got a sneak peek at the low seat, the the low seat, the Techno ET48 2.0. They let me, Techno let me shoot the truck. And I did a full vlog overview in the truck. I even had uh, Jared Wiggins, the guy who was driving the truck, he even kind of walked us through the whole thing. And I did it with the agreement from the owner. The owner was like, don't release it yet. You can shoot it all you want, but release it. I'll let you know when we can release it to build the hype. Um, but for sure, get all the content you want off of it. So this was at Southern Nats. I shot the video. Awesome video. And so what I do, the way, the kind of what I do is I, I, go, I edit everything and then I publish it on YouTube or I upload it on YouTube, but it doesn't publish, right? Um, I set a publish date on when I want it to publish. And uh, in this particular case, because I wanted I wanted to show the owner of Techno what the video was like, because he wanted <laughs> to see what it looked look like, I, um, I made it unlisted. I put it on YouTube as unlisted. I uploaded it. And that's supposed to be where no one can see it unless I give you access to it, or unless I give you the link to it. So I uploaded it. It was an awesome video. I sent it over to uh, the owner of Techno, and I noticed the views were going up. I was like, "Wait a second! There is no, <laughs> there's no way 80 people watch this video already. No way." The views started going up again. I was like, "All right, guys, I got to take it down. Sorry, something happened." Like it, I the way I found out that the views were going up is someone posted on Facebook and said, "Oh man, that's an awesome truck, Mark." I'm like, "What truck? What are you talking about?" And I, the video leaked long story short is the video leaked. Um, so yeah, I felt awful, um, because the owner of techno was like, you know, you weren't supposed to release it yet. It leaked uh, probably 140 people watched it. I felt really bad. However, there is a silver lining to that. I felt like it was like, it was like organic. It was like organic hype. Because people saw it and people were talking about it. There were people copying and pasting. Take people were taking screenshots of the video and posting it on YouTube <laughs> on Facebook. Uh, I contacted the guys. I didn't tell them to take it down, but they were really cool about it. They're like, "Hey, I can take it down. I know you didn't mean to release it. It's all good." Um, but it was like organic hype. Like the hype was super high on this truck, and it hadn't released yet. So we did build the hype, mm-hmm. but I did release it on accident. It was a mistake I made. I felt awful. Like you can ask Melissa. I was. He was sweating. He oh, was, man, like, was... sweating worse than right now. Like, he was... It, it was, was bad. Yeah. It was really, really, really bad. So, this time, um, needless to say, I got the truck early. I signed an NDA. That's a non-disclosure agreement saying that I won't I won't basically release any information on the truck or show the truck until after this date. And uh, this date and time, right? And whenever they sent us the time, they said it was... Um... 9 a.m. CDT, but it's not CDT, it's CST right now. Um, so I was like, I wasn't sure. I didn't want to risk it. So what I did was I woke up early and I uploaded it after the time I could actually show it. Long story short is that's the reason why I delayed it mm-hmm. is because, hold on a second. Cause hold on. Let me, what happened? My computer is about to die. Uh-oh. Yeah, I can't run this on my own. Yeah, you're going to have to figure out why. Well, I just want to give a few shout outs because I did see I, there's Weapon from Farmer's Branch. Well, Weapon Ex- Exican. Uh, let's see. Who else do we have? Hello from Alabama. Jay Powell. Garrett Gregory from Virginia. Oh, I know. Chris and Callie. Oh, there goes the light. Better? Yep. Jason, Iowa City. You got it? Am I charging now? Uh oh. Not good. Who are you? There we go. We're up and going. All right. Hi, Mark from Plano, Texas. Oh, Michael. Sorry, guys. My I, I noticed. Okay, top he's of back. My... He's back. <laughs> she had to take the show on road. <laughs> I noticed at the top of my, my computer was in charge. And I was like, oh, my computer's about to die. That's not good. Um, so yeah, that's why I released that video late. Um, people were like, Ooh, welcome, se- Dante. Seven other YouTubers already released it. Blah blah. Well, yeah, I. I intentionally released it late because I didn't want to violate any agreements that I said. And I'm like a super, super Boy Scout when it comes to that kind of stuff. Yeah, so total. I, I decided to release it. Y'all remember it. the story about him trying to race, right? 
<laughs> That's right. Um, so I didn't release it until I, I, I didn't want to get in trouble. Stan, what's up, bud? Stan is the one that, uh, Stan, thanks for the super chat. You're awesome. Um, he's the one that I believe, and Stan, correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Look, Mark's great with faces, all right? I, I am. I I believe Stan is the guy who sent me the link to the the Traxxas Hawk that I bought, that, that really rare car that I have. Um, super cool car. Um, and he sent me the link. He's like, hey, you should. You should buy this, and I bought it. So, uh, big big shout out! Thanks, thanks a lot, Stan. Um, there was something else I was gonna say. I'm like overly excited about that. I'm not afraid to put people on timeout, but I'm gonna figure it out first because for <laughs> some reason. I, oh I man! Know. All right, so you're excited. So yeah, I uh, <clears throat> I released it an hour late, but. I will say it's an honor to be like, I get that seven other people. I said it was exclusive. That's fairly exclusive. If, Given. They only, if they only sent out seven or eight of these cars. Um, and guys, we made it. I mean, we're basically one of the seven or eight large YouTubers. And YouTubers like RC Sparks, 3.3 million subscribers. Um, there's some other big YouTubers, RC YouTubers out there. They got the car. I'm in there with them. Oh, yeah. RC Driver Online. That's a that's a big magazine. They got like 335,000 subscribers. I got one too, guys. So we made it. And we're, you know, we did this all together. Yeah. I couldn't have done all this, any of this without you guys. And I promise I will pay. Uh-oh. I know. I'm, uh -oh. <laughs> but I don't have the capability. Oh, dang. How do I put dang. him in timeout? You just got to click on the three little dots. Next to his name? Okay. Yep. That's it. Go to sleep. All right. Kellen, go to sleep. Put user in timeout. That's, That's pretty, it. Put it in timeout. I don't know if Kevin no, but it was, got it. It was really exciting because, you know, although he did post it an hour later, it was still very exciting. And, and we'll definitely talk about the car, but I think we want to first and foremost just thank everyone for being here because I think that we oh, did yeah. have a timeout. We did take a vacation and during oh that that's time, right we, we did take a vacation mm -hmm. we did take a vacation and and we're back we're back but with that being said you know one of the things that mark had been working on was gearing up on the youtube and making sure that things were going to still keep running even though we weren't gone so tell us a little bit about that about us being gone yeah yeah so a lot of people were asked like they were confused like i thought you were taking a vacation i did take a vacation um again i'm i'm booked out i've uploaded videos now i'm not and i'll tell you why i'm not but i usually upload videos what can you get elliot <laughs> i'm sorry guys i'm not afraid it's i've <laughs> got kids all right i'm not afraid to put them in it's time uh out. it's my wife what am i supposed to do i gotta i gotta <laughs> listen to what she says um but yeah i i have videos published out pretty far uh usually about a week and a half almost two weeks sometimes so when I take a break, you guys don't really see a break. Yeah. So that's why it was. That's why the timing was off. I said I was going to take a break, and then it kind of went back to normal programming. Whenever I say that I'm going to do an off schedule release, that's because, um, I, dang it, sorry. Okay, that's because <laughs> that's because I I actually released that video the day that I recorded it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So that video that I said, hey, I'm taking a break. That was the day I recorded that video. Um. But yeah, we did take a break. It was an amazing yeah. vacation. We went to New Orleans. We had so much fun. Um, and as much as I said that I was going to take a break and not talk RC, uh, me and Melissa, we talked a lot of business out there. <laughs> yeah, we did. Um, we did. We had, we, it was like, really, it was like a big, I just need to give you the computer, huh? Yeah. So you can start putting Put people, people in time out. No, no, that's I'll, okay. I'll let you do it. I'll just, I'll just make sure that you. But his name is. It's Techno Trugga. I feel like. Wait, wait. What happened? I didn't see that one. What is this? Hide user on this. Can I just do this? I mean, go for it. See what happens. Look, we really don't want to block you oh, guys. Dang. Okay. We really don't. But if you start to spam, it kind of. Yeah, it ruins it for everybody. It does. So, yeah, we did talk a lot of business, and Melissa is going to be more involved. Yeah. Um, she really likes the Facebook group. Oh, guys, if you have not joined the Facebook group, uh, we're going to go over the Facebook group today. Oh, uh, it's, it's awesome. Yeah, um, it is. I agree. I mean, and I've said this already and I'll say it again. Like it, like being here live, seeing the comments, seeing the videos, seeing your comments, 
it's it's great. I see you, but I didn't really see you in the hobby. And so seeing it in the group has totally changed. Like it's a whole new world and I really it's, do love being. So yeah, thank you for everyone. I mean, it's the most interactive, mo I mean, people are posting and commenting and helping each other. We really appreciate that. It's, it's for me. Yeah. I'm like, I told Mark, I'm in. I mean, Oh, look what Jordan's RC said. I love her post. It gets everyone talk, everyone talk flowing. Thanks. Yeah. And that's what she likes. Like, that's her thing. Yeah. Um, the Facebook group is awesome. Yeah. And I love seeing people post and we're going to go over it. But I love seeing people post and then other people helping. Like, yeah, as I soon as someone posts, that. five, six, all the way up to 20 comments right after that. And that's freaking awesome. That's exactly what we wanted with it. And please don't apologize. Kazuma said, I'm there and sorry ahead of time if I post a lot. No, we want you to post. That is the purpose of the group. And you know what? I mean, these days, I think we need more RC related, more fun stuff in our news feed. So have at it. But yeah, absolutely. Um, but yeah, it's been it's been fine. I think only two oh, weeks. I haven't. You haven't shimmied. I haven't, but uh, we we, we, we did <laughs> Oh, dang! Ah. Flexing dog, of course. <laughs> All he right. says talking to self design <sighs> about painting my XB forty twenty one body. That's twenty twenty one. Yeah, painting the old, old, body, old body doesn't, doesn't fit, fit right. Oh, that sucks. Oh man. Um, self designs. That's my painter. I, I used to have them in my description. I need to put them back in there. I took it out because I needed some room in my description for a while. Um. He's painting, a, I basically, I keep him busy. I'm yeah. just shipping bodies over there to him nonstop. But back to, uh, thanks a lot, Dyslexic Dog, for the uh, super chat. Yeah, Greatly appreciate it. that one. No, not, <laughs> not five shimmies. I just, just one shimmy per five dollars, maybe. <laughs> I'm just um, but yes, Melissa is going to be more involved. Yeah. Uh, she, she, she thinks it's awesome to see the people interact. I, I agree. Yeah. And I love tagging marks. <laughs> So, like, yeah. you know, I do. I see sometimes that maybe a question needs to be answered. And I, I don't think Mark's the know-it-all. I, I certainly don't think. But I'm definitely not the know-it-all. <laughs> but it would be nice to just hear his opinion. So, um, I oh, do. Oh, can we talk about the uh, the hater that you got mad at today? Oh. <laughs> oh. It wasn't. Okay, look. It wasn't so much of a hater as a troll. I think those are completely different. Like, he was just trolling. He was trying to get a reaction. And let's just talk about, because I've seen a few questions, the new car release. Stan, what's up, bud? What's up Sorry. with the funny car to the right racing? Is it that one? Yeah, that funny car, I, uh, it's a brand new funny car. I've never read anything. I bought it because I thought they looked really cool. And I had this, I, and I had this idea of putting the weld wheels on it and everything. And the weld wheels are super expensive. So I just keep, Doug, oh, Doug. Doug, you know what? Doug did that just for the shit. <laughs> He did. Dog. He's he gonna wanted to shimmy. He's going to do 99 cents at a time. Make me shimmy. Um, okay, sorry, Melissa. Sorry to cut you off. What were you saying? We are just talking about the new oh, the, Losey. Because I've seen no, some questions. No, you weren't so talking I, about the new Losey. No, we were. talking, we were about, talking the, about the uh, hater. The hater, that's right. Wait, the troll. And I didn't want to really go into it, but I did want to talk about because there's some questions that I've already seen, not only on the post, but um, that I've also have seen in the comments. So do you want to kind of tell us about about the car i mean we've yeah, seen the so video we'll talk about the car but back i gotta address the because uh, the hater thing is funny so, uh, <laughs> so this hater i don't know if i remember his name but he come irrelevant he's commented on like almost every video i've had it'll say some really rude stuff like mark has no idea what he's talking about he's just trying to act like he knows what he's talking he'll say stuff along those lines but he comments on every like why is he watching every video if it's that bad and then he said, hashtag, oh, yeah, unlike. unlike. Um, just so you guys, like, the unlikes that get the same amount of credit as a like. So I don't care. They're all interactions to me. But I just thought it was funny that the guy was so hateful. But he watches every... <laughs> all right. So the car. We're going to talk about the car? Yeah, let's talk about the car. Um, I saw one question come up. Do I like the lift up body? I love the lift up body. Um, I'll do more demos. But I don't want to take it down. It's... It's a big car. It's kind of heavy, but essentially there's four body clips on the bottom. And after you pop the four body clips, the body just comes right up. Um, the only thing I'll say that I've messed up, I'm not going to do it. All right, I'll do it. Are you going to tell us? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put this guy on timeout. Oh, I didn't see. Yeah, he's laughing out loud like crazy. All right. Um, the only thing... He had too much sugar. Melissa, before, Melissa's messed me up with my. Uh, she's gotten me super aggressive at blocking, putting people in timeout. The only thing I'll say about the the body that I won't oh, say that's I did awesome, like, Jason. 
I wish they made them so there's they have headlights, right? So the headlights plug in, and if you lift the body up, the headlights will unplug on like they'll just pull apart. Um, it doesn't break anything. Mm-hmm. Everything's fine, but I kind of wish they made that maybe that wire a little bit longer. I don't know. Did something about that because every time I open it up, I feel like I pull the headlights out on accident. Hasn't broken, but I do like the lift up body. It's super cool. Um, it does just rest after you lift it up. It will just rest, which is super cool too. Um, I like the truck a lot, so much so that I'm going to get another one. Um, I did look at the SMT10 last night when I was mini Z racing with Ethan, which yes, he did beat me. Um, but I did look at the SMT10, <laughs> not even close. Like the cars are so far away from each other in regards to quality. Um, <clears throat> I mean, if you look at this grave digger and you look at the SMT10, the SMT10, I, I don't, I don't want to say anything mean about it. It kind of looks like a Walmart car. I mean, it, it's a cheaper, it's a cheaper lot monster truck, right? So it's supposed to be like that. This is not a cheap monster truck. I can assure you, if you do muster up and spend the six hundred dollars that that the map is, you spend the six hundred dollars on it, you got all six hundred dollars worth for sure. When you when you get it, you're like, wow. Mm-hmm. I mean, it is an absolute tank. And it's um, heavy. Oh, it's heavy. It's super heavy. I know. I saw somebody say, I might get this for, was it my daughter, my niece or something? And I'm thinking, well, that's a pretty dangerous car to give a little girl because, I mean, I just know that, I mean, pedal to the metal and it's going to hurt someone. Yeah, it will. Um, someone said, sorry, they, I insulted the SMT. I think you could make the SMT-10 cool, but there's a lot of, or, there's a lot of that green plastic on it. Um, yeah, I, I just... I guess, I think the problem is, is I saw this truck before I really dug in the SMT-10. That's probably why I'm a little jaded with it. But another thing is this thing is blistering fast. Like, like how fast? I would, I would say, so the Haas is probably a little bit faster than it, but I would say it's that kind of fast. Is like it already out? This? Yeah. Like no, it's, it's, it's not out yet. When does it come uh, out? You can order, you can pre-order it now, and I think the shipping date is January 2021. Um, Do you know how much it is? I may have may not have pre-ordered mine already. <laughs> okay. I so to... I guess this is his way of letting me know. So how much was it? You you got wait. That. How much was it? Six hundred bucks. Uh, you got that for Christmas. Mm-hmm. I appreciate it. You got that for me for Christmas. <laughs> okay. I appreciate it. Uh, um, I another wanted... question I saw though was does what does it come with? Because I think that there was some thing some questions about like, do you have to get some extra stuff or? Um, no, I didn't have to get anything. So okay. I ran the smart battery. I, so it's a 3S. It's 2S, 3S. Um, I ran the 3S smart battery. And I think, uh, so I'm going to talk about it in tomorrow's vlog. Tomorrow's vlog, I actually take it and drive it and jump it. It's, I didn't want to. Like I how far? I can't, no. Like how not, far? <laughs> like, like I, we were watching videos the other day at, um, at Lone Star and people were like putting their freaking cars under all this mud and like Kevin Talbot, how he can build this awesome car, launch it 9,000 feet in the air and snap in half. I, I may, I feel like I just have a little bit more respect. For my car. I, I care about him too much. I like <laughs> my dies. babies. He dies. Hey, so, Wayne wants to know though, <laughs> what were the extra parts? Did you ever find out? I didn't. I probably need to ask. Them. That's okay. <laughs> I probably need to ask them. I was supposed to be on the live. They had a live feed. Um, with the guy who created the truck, mm-hmm. but you were uh, working. I was working. I was actually working, working, and then we had dinner. I had yeah. to take Evan to get his haircut because we're going to the RC Pro Series finals tomorrow. Um, so I was busy, but we were supposed. To, I wanted to get on the live feed. I think that would have been cool. Yeah. Well, why didn't you tell me I would have gotten on? You don't really think about RC. Cars. I don't. These acronyms, they'd be spitting out these numbers. I wouldn't even. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's an awesome truck. So yeah, yeah it's a two S three S. I run. I ran a three S. I did learn an important lesson. Oh, uh, what's up? Can you block? Tyler's going to sleep. Tyler, <laughs> Tyler you're going night-night. He said bye. No, Maybe he's, he's not. leaving. No. We'll and him, Kellen, we'll, too. We'll let him leave. He's not leaving. Do you want the? Do you want this Do you want this control? <laughs> I think I'm going to need that control. <laughs> <laughs> I'll let you. Host I them. love the power. No, I'll I'm just kidding. I really host. don't. <laughs> hey, look. Look oh, what that see, guy said. Conolan... I, want to get a five, I want to get a 5XLT MSM shirt. Did we just contacted our shirt we person did. today yeah. to get five XLTs? She hasn't responded yet, but um Someone said ban Tyler. <laughs> Holy. Um, That's hey, don't take much, but he's got the control. But hold let me finish my thought. All we're, right, we're bad all right. at this with the live feeds because we just jump right into things. Um 
Yeah, 2S, 3S. I did the important thing that I learned uh, is that these cars, it seems like all the all the Arma and this car, they're using the IC5. The IC5 connectors are bigger. Um, and you can get the Spectrum smart batteries in IC3 or IC5. IC3 connectors are smaller. Mm-hmm. I wasn't sure. I, I got an IC5 battery. I wasn't sure if it was going to come in early enough for me to start shooting for me to release. And uh, I ended up going and buying. I went shopping at other hobby shops <coughs> and found a battery with an IC3. I didn't know. I didn't know the difference. So I bought a 3S battery and has an IC3 and I don't. I don't even know what cars come with IC3 anymore. So just make sure if you go get your battery and you want to get a smart battery, you get an IC5 connector smart battery. But that's all I needed. Um, <clears throat> the other thing I learned, hold on. <coughs> you want to you want to ban people, don't you? Yeah, make me moderator. Somebody said make her moderator. That's right, Brian. Power to the power to the people. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, just ignore them. Oh, okay. Um, oh, the other thing I learned, which this, I didn't know this. This threw me off. The Spectrum remotes are, are pretty solid. Like, I like them a lot. The DX3 that came with it. Um, but it's a one model remote. So I ended up getting a DX5C remote. That way I didn't have to carry. I don't, because I have remotes everywhere, right? Um, what I like to do is I like to buy kits and keep the remotes in the box. That way if I ever give it away or sell it i have the stock remote with it i made the mistake before rice to sell those remotes and then whenever you need them back they cost a lot to get back so <laughs> i don't sell uh <laughs> i've not gone power crazy guys how big is it compared oh god hi eric should we just start maybe i do need to give you yeah can you how do you do that i would just have to hit pass you my computer <laughs> no you can i think you just Make me some kind of wizard. I mean, moderator. Oh. Anyways, oh, so if they want to, if if bot bot world wants to uh, ask his question, he can super chat. <laughs> I'm not answering any questions that are getting sc- scrolled. How about that? Um, because that bothers everybody. But yeah, you don't need anything other than that. I did get a DX5C. You don't need that. I got it because I don't want several remotes, and I got the smart battery because I thought the smart battery. I like the smart technology. I think it's mm-hmm. really cool. I actually think I'm going to let Ethan run the smart batteries. Um, it's easy to, uh, easy to use. So Yeah. All right. right. I was going to say, ahead. what makes them so smart? Huh? What makes them so smart? You can You just plug them up. You don't have to set the settings on it. You just plug them up and hit charge. Oh, thank you, RC Genius. That was the other question. Is the wheelie bar on the low C LMT removable? I've collected the Traxxas. Uh, Monster Jam trucks, trying to get an idea of how the low C compares. Thank you, RC Genius. I knew um, there was another question. They don't compare. Mm-hmm. I know that sounds bad. You know, guys, I'm a Traxxas, a super <clears throat> Traxxas fanboy. It does look like the wheelie bar comes off, but they, they don't really compare. Yeah. And I say that because the the Traxxas Monster Truck was made for, a, it's like a more of like an entry level, someone that wants, like, it. they, Traxxas was genius by making that truck. They're selling them at Monster Jams. They're affordable. Like, that's what they made it for. Mm-hmm. This is more for, like, a hobbyist. Someone a collector. Who's actually, uh, yeah, collector. Yeah. Someone who's actually doing, like, Monster Jam type uh, rallies. Maybe in their backyard or they set up a track or something like that. There is a following for Monster Jam type things. Yeah. That's what this is. This is not, like, a hot, like, a fun, like, a, a beginner car at all. So. Well, and you'll have it with you this weekend, right, at the race? Do what? You'll have it this Michael, weekend at the race. Michael Sherman, what's up? Are you ready to buy my felony? <laughs> Michael Sherman is the guy that... Uh... Oh, here we go. Here we no, go. No, no, I know okay, Michael. Okay, okay, okay. Michael Sherman was the one who I bought his X-Max. Michael Sherman's the guy who buys cars, drives it once inside the house, and says he doesn't want them anymore, and then he sells them <laughs> really cheap. Man, you are going to have to take over the... Uh... Yeah, come on. All right, fine. I'm going to... I don't know. I'm going to block Colby because Jason Weedle is a... Oh, I almost blocked Jason Weedle on action. <laughs> uh, because Jason Weedle is a uh, a Patreon. Which, by the way, we're going to do the Patreon giveaway. That's right. That's that right. That's quick. right. Um, today we're giving away for the Patreons. Uh, we're giving away one of these. I bought this last night at, at Lone Star. This is the mini Truggy. The 28 scale Truggy. These are actually pretty freaking... Oh, oh. Pretty freaking sick. Uh, it actually matches. Bye, Merle. Thank you for joining. 
I don't know. Oh, Merle's leaving? Well, he said later. Merle. Merle? Merle? Merle. No, don't leave, bud. This is this you're on, I think you're on the you're on this giveaway. You don't want to leave. Um so we're going to spin for this and then we're going to spin for one of my favorite tools, the 4 in 1 Protec torque wrench. This is I had these are spares that I had a whole bunch of. Mm-hmm. Um <clears throat> yeah, we're going to spin for these two. So these two things are going to be going to the Patreon. So let me change to that scene. Get some uh questions while I do this Musa so I'll mess this up. What is the well RC nerd? RC nerd? What is the best truck to start racing with? The best truck to start racing with? Mm-hmm. Um, I think the best truck to start racing with, if you have the class, is definitely the Spec Slash. We keep forgetting that, and I love it. Thank you, Jordan. I think Jordan's RC always reminds us, but we do. We have to remember. Li- smash oh, yes. that like button. Smash the- why, why do we forget that? I don't know. Speaking of Jordan's RC, they ordered a, I think they ordered a crap ton of shirts. Oh, oh my go. God, the shirt sold out like crazy. I actually, I said <clears throat> I was only going to make 50, not 50. I made 100. a lot more than that. Yeah, so I was, I was going to make a limited amount of the camo with black. I, I got to get more. Yeah. I, <laughs> it sold out way too fast. Yeah, we're ordering <clears throat> some more for sure. Yeah, Merle got two. Is it Merle? We're not even going to try it. All right, so we're going to spin... This is going to be for the uh, four-in-one wrench. Uh, this is going to should be a pretty. So, Jay Powell, this is for the Patreon. So, aside from the Facebook group, you've got a Patreon group. Oh Tell yeah, us a little bit about the Patreon group. So the Patreon, oh, I want to see Merley should be on here. Oh, Jason, John. Oh, I, got I, I mine. think he's a five dollar. Uh, a five dollar. So Patreon <laughs> is basically a way to support content creators. Um, at the end of the day, what could happen is YouTube can say. No, we're done with you guys. Mm-hmm. And then that's it. So this is the way you can support content creators. It gives more, it gives kind of puts the power in the content creator's hands, which is the way it should be, right? So <clears throat> I guess it what shouldn't be. I mean, YouTube does a lot, so. But it helps uh, the content creators a lot. So if you go and sign up, I have three tiers. I have a $5 tier, a $10 tier, and then uh, I think it's a pretty high dollar tier. But that high dollar tier, you get like one-on-one stuff, and then you get links in my descriptions, things like that, which yeah. if you have a company that does help a lot because mm-hmm. uh, my, my descriptions do get clicks um, and uh, they, they should, cause they save you guys money. So let's go and spin for the uh, four and one wrench. Hey, so Christopher <clears throat> Taylor goes neon orange camo. Actually, that would be a nice setup because on the track, like, neon orange camo. Yeah. What do you think? Neon orange shirt with, or neon orange camo. You, uh, people tell us. You can just call me Johnny. He said, <laughs> thank you. Jeez. <laughs> Um, but I, <laughs> we're so, terrible with names. The most importantly, when it comes to Patreons, that's where I, I respond to everyone on Patreon. So the guys who I actually talk to are on Patreon. They're asking me support questions like help with this, help with that. And not that and he I, doesn't talk to others, but yeah, you just, I, I, I do whenever I have time. Yeah. That's the app that you make sure the notifications come through and that you're checking them. So, so. you could talk to me through the Facebook group, but you got to get past Melissa. Yeah. So, <laughs> Melissa will tag me and be like, answer that question. And I got to answer it. Oh man. What's up? Weapon. Weapon. Mexican. Ex- <laughs> any, In- any insight on the low C one, eight mini T. Oh man. I, what is that? Stay tuned. My friend. Stay oh, tuned. spoiler. Oh, spoiler. <laughs> That's spoiler alert. Stay tuned, sir. Oh, Aaron, Stay I've tuned. never won a giveaway. Got to flip the script. Who do I think it's going to be? Oh, please don't be. Wait, oh. what? Oh, looks like Oliver, maybe. Is it going to be me? I'm not even on there. Oh, looks like it's going to be Chris. That's going to keep moving. How can you tell? Oliver, I guess... Chris. Oliver, Chris. Oliver. Wait, where'd my pen go? There it is. Oliver awesome. is the winner. Oliver Manchester, congratulations if you are on live. I haven't seen his name, but he could have an incognito name. All right. So, Oliver Manchester, you won the ProTech wrench. That wrench is not just a nitro wrench. It does uh, take out glow plugs, but it does a whole bunch of other stuff also. Um, is it smart? It's not smart. It's not smart <laughs> All right. So, let's go and spin for the cool thing, the little mini truggy, and then we'll talk more about um this is um the boys have had these right yeah they're so much they fun. love they're, these they're perfect that's what you house. set up we set up a mini track inside right price tag still on there let me take that off 
No, I'm joking. Y- y'all can see what it costs because... And you know what was awesome? Look, look at that box. That fits it. That box over there fits it perfect. Over there. What are we Never pointing mind. at? Fingers crossed. All right. Let's see. How many people we have on while we're doing this? Oh, whoa. 262. I didn't 262. even see the number. Oh, my gosh. That is insane. Whoa. I didn't even see. I mean. All right. So. Guys. While this is spinning. Yes. Melissa is going to participate more. So I'm going to RC Pro Series this weekend. Mm-hmm. And Melissa is going to redo this room. Yes. We're going to make this room into a recording studio. Um, she's going to. I, I let her. Like, we're, we're putting money in this thing. I let her just go all out on Christmas decorations. We, this is going to be our Christmas set for during Christmas time. We've got an amazing Christmas surprise for you guys. It's going to be epic. Yeah, it's, it's going to be awesome. I'm so excited. Yeah. Like, <clears throat> I should be excited to race RC Pro this weekend, which I am. But I'm even more excited to get back yeah. and start shooting these. Yeah, because you're going to get back <laughs> and this is going to be transformed. Oh, guys. man. And I let her, she likes to do the. Oh, is it going to be Jason? I think it's going to be Jason. It says, how do I... Um, it's going to be Jason. Jason's going to win the and you're gonna, R28. Yeah, so... Oh, wait. Or is it going to go past Jason? Jason is... The, he ta- he wears MSM shirts. Jason Weedle wins the art. The awesome. R28. Oh, weapon XP. Oh, thanks. Hey, shimmy, thanks. Shimmy, shimmy, oh, yeah. shimmy. I got to do two shimmies. Congrats, uh, Jason. Thanks, Weapon Mexican. That's a funny name, by the way. Weapon Mexican. Um... Oh, crap. Where did my piece of paper go? There's oh, geez. Here. I'm a hot mess. Um, well, Merle, Johnny, the um, giveaway is kind of glitchy. John but... Merle. Is it Merle? <laughs> I want to no. know what it is. The giveaway, what is How do it? you enter for this? Well, is Patreon it is the names of that are on the wheel are from Patreon. Yep. So, uh, yeah, Patreon. Is that is... Tamaya? That brand? No, that is uh, Associate, Team Associate. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, so Patreon is a way. Basically, it's it's um, and I got a lot of them. Man, I, it's fun. I, I answer questions all the time. I, I would say no more than a day late. I need to answer more questions tonight, but it's direct connection to me. I mean, we yeah. I'll answer all your questions on there. Yeah, yeah, Andrea, are yeah. are all the people in the wheel part of your Patreon? Yeah. Yes, yeah. everyone. Uh, so you, it's one of the tiers you can get entered to the giveaways. I do those giveaways once a month, every mm-hmm. second Saturday. Uh, I did them tonight because I'm going to be gone this weekend. Okay. And I didn't want to do it at the track. Uh, which, speaking of, this has nothing to do with what I'm talking about. I don't know why I said speaking of. <laughs> Thursday night. We're recording Thursday night. This is actually a special time for me. Because this was when we used to record on the tone. Oh, yeah. Thursday night used in to be. In this room. In this room. Yeah. We even have some of the banners back there still. Um, on the tone. Every Dan, what's up, Dan, bud? The oh, man. that's Dan. Oh. Shimmy, shimmy. <laughs> Dan, uh, Dan. Oh, so, oh, here we go. Okay, Story I'm not, time. I'm not gonna mess it up. Story time. Shout out, Dan. He's a Patreon. Appreciate it, bud. Um. So yeah, we used to record the podcast in here, and that was a good time. Um. But you know what? There's a lot of haters in the race. <laughs> <laughs> Not haters, just hate in general. But, but it was just of, a totally it's different. It's a completely yeah, different. Yeah, it's a totally that different. That racer community. Yeah. It, Merle. Are, Thank you, Wayne. Merle. Merle. Jeez, see, like Merle. Spanish is my first language. I don't know about him, but <laughs> I try my best with names. That racer community is awesome. Yeah. They're like a family. Weapon Mexican. Yay! I want one of those mini, mini tees. Can't, Can't wait for the video. video. What video? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just joking. Um... Yeah, it's just a different group, and uh, I was just telling Melissa, like, so when we just do the podcast, I used to come in here, and I would be, like, completely, uh, sorry, let me answer Joel's, Go Joel's ahead. question. Go ahead. Go uh, ahead. Joel, thanks for the super chat, bud. There's your shimmy. Uh, what do you recommend for a beginner for a beginner nitro? I, look, you're going to screw crap up on your first nitro. Mm-hmm. No doubt you're going to blow an engine. Something's going to happen. You're going to do something wrong. Get a cheap beginner nitro. Get a like a, a nitro rustler. That's a good beginner nitro. Don't get anything with a crazy transmission. One speed transmission, stadium truck, something like that. I think that's the best beginner nitro. And a sweat rag. Yes. Because <laughs> you will be. And you like you're gonna. <laughs> the worst is you go. Everyone in nitro has got at least gone through one time where they were popping plugs. 
glow plugs are not cheap. Like five to ten dollars, and, and I'll you tell pop you what, like two or three in a night. Oh, and I don't miss you racing nitro. Like I'm going, going to I'm races. Going back. No, well, I won't be going to the races. But when he is racing nitro, he does not even have time to just sit and breathe. He is running and gunning, and he is sweating and he is stressed. But yeah, they but, have fun. Y'all have fun. But so. speaking of running and gunning, when we did the podcast, yeah, I would be like stressed out because mm-hmm. I'm setting up for four different people. Like yeah. getting, we used to have call in, call in people. Like I was super stressed. I was running around like crazy. And the other guys, which I love the other guys, Peter, Tony, um, Tyler, they literally just came with their drinks, sat down, and just started going. And it was like, man, it was such a beating. Everyone's like, let's do the podcast, let's do the podcast. But no one was putting in that time like me, and it was it was like super stressful to get ready and everything. Um, now, like we're doing this now, and yeah, it's still kind of stressful, but you're helping, like Melissa helps me, mm-hmm. right? So um, it's it's really nice. Um Oh, oh, and Rogers, what's up? <laughs> I won the new Arma Big Rock Crew Cab V3 last week, so not winning tonight. I guess it's okay. Where did, you, where did you win the Arma Big Rock Crew Cab? That's awesome. I loaded that in my cart the other day. Did I you? I was like, do I get it? But I, guys, I am probably, me and Melissa, she almost convinced me to release every day, including weekends. Yeah, like almost. I almost had them. Almost. <laughs> Almost. Because yeah. here's the thing. We're going to be doing these Christmas videos. Mm-hmm. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and spoil it. Spoil it. Oh. We're going to do, and this is still in the process, right? We're still thinking about this. We're still trying to get this. Um, this is all still marinating. Um, but we're going to do something along the lines of um, 12 days of Christmas. Absolutely. Yep. And uh, every day, this is what I envision. Okay. Let's I hear envision a uh, Christmas tree, big Christmas tree. Yes. With a bunch of Christmas presents around it. And all these Christmas presents, I'm going to let you guys choose which Christmas present to open. I like. Um, but the Christmas present will be a present that I think is a great Christmas gift for any like RC people. Like an RC okay. Christmas gift. So they're going to be RC Christmas suggestions. Some of the stuff. Doug, what's up, bud? Hello from Cali. Good luck on the race this weekend. Looking to buy my second Traxxas slash Ultimate or Max. Totally different rigs. They are completely different rigs, but right now I am a big Slash Ultimate. Um, I, I think the Slash Ultimate, <laughs> it's the best bang for the buck. I'm going to do a vlog on that soon. That's my recommendation. Um, but yes, big big Christmas tree, lots of presents around it. You guys pick a present. Um, some of the things are things that I did want. Mm-hmm. Oh. <laughs> like I've been wanting, right? And we're just going to open it on the air and I'm going to tell you guys. But yeah, we're going to give you a whole bunch of Randy Scott. Dang. Dang, coming in. Uh, thanks for the super chat. Love, Love the new... LMT digger. Oh man, the, the that's LMT awesome. digger is awesome. Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. Sorry. So yeah, <laughs> that's what we're gonna do. Twelve days of Christmas, different Christmas gifts. We're gonna Melissa's got all like not only twelve days of Christmas, but that's twelve vlogs, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You realize twelve vlogs? That's three weeks of vlogs. We don't have that much time till Christmas, guys. Guys, it's coming. So we're it's... either gonna be releasing every day, or we're gonna be releasing twice a day. We might do the twelve days of Christmas live feeds every night like 20 minute live feeds where i unbox it and just and show you guys i'm even thinking about going as far as getting like a santa costume like a santa outfit um i don't know we'll see uh, we got lots we got a going lot, on a lot yeah uh, again i'm going out race this weekend melissa's gonna come do all this room up i'm excited to see what it's gonna be like and uh it's gonna be epic yeah it's gonna be a crazy christmas guys um we're putting a lot into it it's gonna be freaking awesome yeah Got my shirts today. Oh man, the shirts turned out. I, I, I think they're awesome. Um, obviously, they're freaking awesome. <laughs> Nathan, what's up, bud? Uh, just to say hi. You two are doing a phenomenal job. Continue success and keep the two boys kicking butt. Thanks. Oh yeah, they, uh, Ethan kicked my butt last yeah. night. Yeah. And did. you know what sucks? And is he like, came back actually humble. Well, yeah, because What's... he won. If I would have beat him, he would have not come home. <laughs> um, but, you know, all my buddies, all my race buddies, they just like pour, they just rub salt in the wound every time he beats me. Um, uh, Randy Scott, he said, love the LMT Grave Digger. Guys, like I said, I would be surprised. Yeah. Absolutely surprised if anyone who bought the LMT Grave Digger said, oh, man, that's it. Like, it, yeah. my God, this it is a built machine. Bank, we have not. He's what? asking if we've raced in New Jersey and no, we haven't. Them. So, 
twenty twenty one will be a big a big year for us. Yeah, we're gonna do more travel. Hopefully, more travel. Hopefully, let's just. Oh yeah, we won't say anything about that. Yeah, we're gonna do our best to do more travel. Um, yeah, Melissa, she's having so much fun doing this, so she's in. Yeah. Um, she's gonna be helping out a lot. Um, the group is getting bigger, guys. If you haven't, if you're not part of the Facebook group, I'm telling you guys, you're gonna like it. Yes. Another reason why I started the Facebook group is I get a lot of things that I want to give away, right? Mm-hmm. And this has already happened in the past where I've given something away to someone who didn't need it. Uh, I don't want that to happen. Oh. Holy crap, guys, coming in with the Super Chats. Christopher Taylor, big shout out. Thanks a lot, bud. There's your shimmy. <laughs> Arrow dogs. That sounds like a flying a flying guy. I need to fly sometime. Oh, we're getting a drone. That would be cool. Yeah. There's your shimmy. Oh, why do I got to shimmy so I hard? Gonna, I yeah, I don't. You're like supposed to shimmy with your shoulders. Can like you that? do that? Yeah. What about more like a But why a do you roll? do it with your chest? Like you're like because... trying to get your chest. No, no, no. <laughs> you break your neck, sister. Um. So yeah, we're going to do more. We're going to do more travel next yeah. year. I, we're, we're excited about yeah, that. Yeah, we want to. We love the YouTube community and it's been so great. And we're, uh, we're not. He's not going anywhere. But the no, Facebook I'm group. Not. Yeah, I think a a lot of us do live on Facebook, and so I was oh, telling... Oh, that, that, that's what yes. we were talking yes, about. Yes, okay, yes. let me say something to the commission. I, I forget, so okay. whenever I start shimmying, I, it shimmies the, the thoughts out of my head. The commission. <laughs> uh, what is the story... Of what is the story M3. of the M3? And what is the name of the Facebook group? Oh, the M3? This is... It's a Scrabble. It's a Scrabble piece. Yeah. There's no story behind it. No? And we're both <laughs> Mark and Melissa. Super chat, though. Yeah, no, um, Mark and Melissa. Oh, and you know what people did ask? What are you drinking? I'm drinking the caramel. Oh, dang, no, I can't spoil it. I have a tendency to spoil stuff. I know. Um, you will see on a coming upcoming vlog. Um, Jason Weedle, what's up, bud? Good luck this weekend. We'd love to see more EB40. Oh, of course, I'm racing it this weekend. Yeah. We'll be getting one soon. EB48 2.0, amazing race car. My favorite race car right now. Um, I love the car. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> I'll go back to that in a second. Okay. But the Facebook group, the reason why I wanted to do it so bad is, again, I was giving the stuff away to people who didn't need it. Um, that was, like, bothering me a little bit. I had a lot of these mini... Um, don't let me miss that one. I had a lot of these mini... <laughs> mini I say uh, something. 16 scale brushless systems that I want to give away. But I'm scared that people are going to try to to win it just to win it and they don't need it. So what I want to do with the Facebook group is I want... When I give something away, I want them to... Uh, I want them to post a picture of the car that they want to put it in with their name next to it. Yeah. So I know that I'm giving it to someone who actually needs it. Well, I mean, it's more than that. But let's get to the okay, shimmying sorry. real quick. Jordans, what's up, bud? I would love to see your perspective. Your perspective from the race this weekend. Absolutely. Don't worry about the commentary. Just video and drive. There you go. Um, yeah, because the last time I video and drove at the uh, th- at uh, the turf track, I could, like, it was going so fast. I couldn't. Turf is like, you got to have your super mental acuity. I couldn't talk the whole Do time. Do you? Yeah, it was tough. Yeah. Uh, Weapon Exican. I joined the Facebook group. Awesome. All right. Good job, Weapon. Yeah, dude. You're going to love that. Yeah. Weapon. I just called Weapon like it was his first name. <laughs> <laughs> Dan, should someone someone should sell me their DOD 48.4 tower? I have one. Okay. I have one. Which? I have one. That's another, that's another in the works. We're opening a store online. I don't like selling anything. I mean, he really doesn't. That's I, why I just people, like, 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 Dan, if I was to get it, I would just give it to you. Well, <laughs> I don't like and, selling anything. And the, I'll trade. I did a trade the other day. Yeah. Um, but I don't like selling anything. Yeah. I, it's, it, I feel weird selling stuff. I don't what like is the this. Facebook group called? It is called MSM Drivers Meeting. Drivers Meeting. Yeah. Drivers like Drivers meeting. meeting? Like, you know, you start with the Drivers Meeting? Yeah. Um, but yeah. So, yeah, I want to make sure I give stuff away to yeah. people who actually need it. Someone did bring up a good point. Uh, that, you know, I'm giving stuff away. Um, someone said you should just sell it cheap because someone who actually needs it would actually buy it <clears throat> as opposed to someone who... It's they're... a mixed basket. Look, you can't... Yeah, like, I tough. think you try to capture as much as you can. I think ultimately what he's really trying to say... Holy Whoa! crap, Joel! Jeez. Oh, he's going to nationals. Wait, where's nationals? All right, uh, what do you, no, do he you needs, recommend he needs for a beginner to go to the... <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> do you recommend a beginner to go to a nationals? Absolutely, absolutely. If if if, if I'm reading the question, do you recommend for a beginner to go to a nationals race? Yeah, yeah. Go to all the big races you can. Don't worry about how you do. Get the experience. Get the uh, just the feel of it. 
you want you want basically you want to go to as many big races as you can and you want to get super nervous. That way when you are on that big stage, it's not as bad. And I tell this to uh Evan and it's funny cuz we'll watch races. And if you ever see two fast guys go at it, you'll have one guy that's got a lot of experience and another guy who maybe he's been doing it for a year or so. The guy that has a lot of experience, nine times out of ten will win. And it's because it's not it doesn't get to them. Like mm-hmm. they're so used to it. And that's why I get Ethan and Evan and, and Mini Z's when I do get them. Uh, it will be we're side by side and they just they they crumble. Like it's like you have to get that experience and you have to get that feeling. And the you the more you do it, it's not a big deal. Yeah. Um so yes, absolutely go to the national. But is it not nerve wracking? Uh, Joel thinks oh my god. Like, I get so nervous that my whole body, like, it feels like pins are going through my entire body. So, what do you suggest to Joel? Like, okay, obviously, you know, he's a beginner. He wants to go to Nashville. Go like, there just for fun. To have fun. Um, yeah. Take the element of winning out. Take the, don't even yeah. think about how well you do. Um, go there, have fun, socialize, mm-hmm. get to know some people. All those pro drivers should be nice. If they're not, they're not great pro drivers. Um, they Message should all, Mark they should and all he'll talk, talk to, to them. You. Yeah. Was, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. Honestly, like, there's a couple of guys that are going to meet me at uh, the the Pro Series Finals this weekend. I would, Theodore, but and, I don't have power. And I'm going to take them around and meet people. Like, if you ever see me at a race and you want to meet nerd. one of those pros, hit me up. Yeah. And I'll take you in there. Um, I know... What's <clears> up, John? Chuck. Chuck met me at uh, Southern Nats. He wanted to meet T-Bow and those guys. Mm-hmm. I brought him out. Like, we met... The big name pros, they love that. They love that. They they want people in the hobby. They yeah. want to socialize. They they it's it's flattering to them. They like it. That's what that's what they do it for. So reach out to them. But yeah, yeah absolutely go to a nationals race. Um, now nationals. The only thing I'll say about nationals race. Yes. They're a little bit pricier than normal races. Yeah. Big national races are usually the entry fees are between fifty and maybe even up to two hundred dollars per car. <clears throat> per right? car. Per so car. they can be a little pricey. So. If you go, run one class, get the experience, and I promise you will have when the next time you go to the track after you go to that big nationals race, mm-hmm. you will have that uh, <clears throat> that uh, that confidence, and that's what it's all about is confidence. Yeah. yeah, and that's that's really where I think doing the smaller races kind of helps too. So even not thinking about the nationals, just doing yeah, more just of, like, doing a whole bunch of races. yeah, doing yeah. a whole bunch of races. So. Yeah. Just uh, curious though, where are you at though? Um, Joel, thanks a lot by the way. Yeah, thank you. Where are you at, Joel? Just curious, but um, and then hold on, Damn, I saw a question. Fruit flies. Oh, I did see somebody out. asked about the coffee that they want to get their parents some. Great thinking about already Christmas, <coughs> but he asked, uh, "What uh, coffee would you recommend? What flavor of the Tony's coffee would you recommend?" I think Carmelita is pretty. Carmelita is awesome. Yeah. Yeah, it was big and cool RC school. So he's, hey, Mark, I'm looking to get my parents some coffee for Christmas. Which, hey, he's already thinking about Christmas. That's that's it. That's where we're at, guys. Like, we are yes, almost there. We're so. almost there. Yeah, we yeah. got so much stuff. Um, someone said also Tebow and he also Tebow and he was also like didn't want to talk. So the only reason why <laughs> Tebow would not want to talk is if he was like, he wants, he's competitive. Yeah. And that's what he does for a living. Yeah. All uh, right. So, you might so be he's super competitive. And so, and... so if he's super busy, he's obviously he's got to, he's there to work and that's his job. So but other than that, man, those guys are super freaking cool. Yeah. All of them are super cool. <laughs> Tristan goes, I just saw the picture of you on the Facebook page with the techno face mask. <laughs> <laughs> you wanna go let's or how much time? Yeah, let's go through. Let's All go right, through so real quick. Just a few I set, minutes. I set but... up this scene. You guys don't know Oh, what that means. Alan Bipro. Any interest in the low C tenacity DB Pro? Uh, the low C tenacity DB Pro. I don't know what that car Welcome, is. Welcome, OG Scoop. But you know what? I'll give it a shot. Baton Rouge! We just went through Baton Rouge! Hey, Joel. I gotta look up the low C tenacity. I am from quick. Baton Rouge, yeah. yeah actually, you <laughs> even wanted to go and stop, but we were ready to We just we drove right through Baton Rouge. Man, by the oh yeah, that car looks pretty cool. So low C tenacity looks like a, almost like a UDR buggy. Um, I think those are cool. If that class took off, I'm gonna try all different types of classes. By the way, um, all right. So let's see. I'm gonna pull this up. The low C tenacity looks super sweet. I think if especially questionably Xavier, give Mel the power of banning. Yes, 
She needs it. I do. I need it. <laughs> oh. Hold on. I'm switching the the old. All right. Check out this Hey, one. Adam Weege. What do you think of the Axial SCX 124? Or uh, one... Stay tuned. Oh, another one. Stay, stay tuned. tuned. All right. So here's the. So that's the picture that they were. <laughs> you don't see it yet. <clears throat> you can actually, if you want to look over here on my screen, you can see. I can see. All right, so this is the MSM drivers meeting. This, how does it look on there? It, it looks look good. good. It looks good. You're live. Oh yeah. All right. So <laughs> it's not. That's a joke. That's not supposed to go over your face <laughs> like that. It's supposed to just go over the middle part, like your nose and mouth. Um, yeah. So I'm not watching the live feed, by the way. Anymore. I'm watching okay. it. I'm watching it. <clears throat> but yeah, I got a couple of these techno masks. They're super cool. I. Problem now is I have MSM mask and techno mask. I'll probably wear my techno mask this weekend. But look, let's go through some of this stuff. Oh, hey, Gregory this? Edwards, can you message me? Because he says he wants to start racing but can't afford short course truck. What is the best suggestion for a cheaper truck? So either post in the MSM drivers meeting and tag me and we'll make sure to get your answer. Dang. See, you got to get past. Like if Melissa tells me to answer, I got to. So look at this car. Look at how sweet that oh, thing I is. Oh, I love that post. Did you see what that post was though? Which one? This one? Yeah. Let's read it real quick. Go back up. If I could ask for some help, could use some help in a think tank. I'm planning on painting a body Seattle Seattle Sounders for my dad's. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. I'm going to order some colors. Just some fields should be done here. Oh, that's super cool. I have a big art background. Wow. Thanks, J Pal. Glad to have you. We'll we'll prove in a little bit. Yeah, that's um that's super cool. Yeah, you just gotta make sure you got a paint a cool a good painter that can <laughs> paint that. No, I think he said he was painting it. Yeah, Is you, need a, you need an airbrush. An airbrush, but yeah, absolutely. If you're artistic, that's like my painter, self designs. Man, he that's what he does. So All I've right. seen some videos on YouTube about this RC, and I thought I'd give it a try. Only forty five dollars. Didn't think you would get get it this fast, but here it is. That looks pretty sweet. See, this is the kind of stuff on the on the. Oh look, this guy. He just got another RC car today. That looks just like my blue one. That's super Can you do cool me a favor? Car. Can you put um, Mr. Mrs. Cooper in timeout? All right, hold on, let me find him. Mr. and Mrs. Cooper in timeout. I don't Where know. It's Lene. Lene. You can just put him in timeout. Uh, they can join the Facebook group and ask there. I'll, but... I'll put him in there for good. <clears throat> oh, there's uh, Melissa saying thanks. Let's go some more cars. Look at this car. I'm building an uh, Arma Dual Outcast. Basically, two Arma Outcasts put together. Look at that. That's like a super long one. That's pretty sweet. Uh, look, people posting videos on here. Guys, this is awesome. I mean, I love having the Facebook group. We're kind of just jumping in just to kind of look at some posts. But ultimately, you know, we'd love the oh, engagement. People look are, at this one. I saw that. This I just one saw is that. awesome, guys. So I remember I unboxed that uh, that car that I bought. That new, that not, it's not new. Yeah. Um, that old... Uh, Tech Traxxas Hawk. This guy found a Traxxas Hawk. See, look, he says, "Look what I, <laughs> he made me do." Once I saw your video, I started hunting for one. He came across this one in his local area in good shape. Nice. This thing is impeccable for how old it is. Oh, that's the vintage one. Yes, oh, that how thing funny. looks sweet. Um, yeah, see people comment all this. Look, that's a sweet Bronco. That's one of my favorite crawler look looking crawlers. Is that Bronco? Um. See, this guy needed help. Put your Facebook page on here, please. Maybe a link. Yes, I'm going to get the link. No, the link is actually in the description. If you it want is, to check but out I'll get it real quick because that way they can have it in the comments. But yeah, go on in there. That's where I'm going to be giving away a lot of my, the things that are a grave digger. Why? Wow, I wanted a tech. <laughs> no, but this is awesome. Yeah, we really enjoy, I mean, the, the page has been great. We're definitely doing more things. So definitely stay tuned for that. Um. I do want to go through and ask some questions, though. Um, ask me questions? Yes. So. Oh, look. Hold on. Wait. Would oh, you rather? Oh. oh. Most people like rather race. Those are my racing. Or movies. all. I saw all, too. All of them. Wrench mm -hmm. and build, crawl, collect. I. You know what? I'm going more towards the collecting side myself. Yeah, that's just because you don't want to drive them. And that's the I reason why Mark has Oh, so look many. at this deal. This guy bought three X-Maxes, $400 each. Those are the new ones. Unreal. That's killer. All right. Sorry. We won't flood it with that. Yeah. Go ahead, Melissa. I can't find your name on Facebook to tag you. It doesn't pop up. Oh, man. It's, should just be Melissa Can, too. 
Uh, All right. Back, back to it. I collect. Yeah, I think that that's kind of always been your mode. Like, you've always, first of all, liked to buy two of everything. And oh, yeah. so Unfortunately, I like to buy two of everything. That's part of the reason why I have a hard time uh, driving my EB48 2.0 so much, because I only have one. Yeah. But you never, you don't ever want to buy two race cars. Yeah. Because once the race cars go obsolete, they're basically not worth very much. Hey, uh, we, Andy. He says, hey, guys. Loving all the way from Melbourne. Um, I shipped to Australia the other day. With a single servo set up on an E-Revo, do Love I it. need to change anything to do with the steering, servo saver, etc.? No. Okay. I run the same servo saver. Um, you basically just take one of the sides off. It should hold up just fine. I haven't had any problems with it. And Tanner's dying to know, are you interested in any oval racing? Uh, I am. So, and I think I've said this before, my, my problem with oval racing is what I really focus on, what I like to focus on is... This is freaking blinking. It's distracting me. What I really focus on is is building the hobby mm-hmm. up, right? Um, and there's not a good, at least around me, there's not a good entry class for me to push people to. Like, as soon as I'm done with this year, this month is a mm-hmm. big month for me. Uh, we have the RC Pro Series Finals, which I believe I'm I'm either leading or top three in both North Thanks and for South joining, RC Adam. Pro Series. Um, Evan is leading the RC Pro Series and Future Pros. Uh, but this is a big month for me. Mm-hmm. So, but after I get done racing RC Pro Series finals, then I have a benefits race after that. Then I have the Truck Nationals after that. That's three race weekends in a row. I'm really going to be focusing on building the spec slash class up. Um, I think slashes are one of the coolest Christmas gifts you could get anybody. Um, I bought my son slashes a long time ago. That was their first cars, right? Like five, No, not their first cars. They oh. had cars before that. Um, but I bought them like maybe four or five years ago and they still drive them um and they you can race them so i'm going to be really pushing to try to get more people to get slashes for their christmas presents things like that and building that spec slash class up it's Thanks, gonna be Merle. awesome he said this page is way way cool <laughs> yeah the page is oh my god the, yeah, page, the page is, page awesome. is awesome you can sit there and scroll on it and and have fun on there all day but i will say the moderator is pretty hardcore She's pretty <laughs> i don't take crap man Oh, Dan, check, check out, out my, my wiring, wiring job. With one post down on Facebook. Let me go see. <laughs> he was probably waiting for me to go to his post and I just stopped. Right oh, when Kevin, I... that's awesome. He said his oldest son is getting slashed for Christmas. That's going to be exciting. And then it says, Dan, you never reported what you thought about the cheap Amazon servos. How did you like them? Oh, hold on a second. That was Stan, the man. Stan, um. About the cheap Amazon servos. I haven't blown one yet. Oh, so you... They're pretty good. Uh, they have a lot of torque. A little slow, a lot of torque. They seem really well right now. I haven't blown one, so they're doing great. And one of them's on Ethan's car. Yeah. Everyone knows how Ethan drives. <laughs> um, let me show you guys this real quick, because this is actually pretty good. <clears throat> he wanted me to see his wiring job. Sorry, uh, Gregory. I'm not sure, but I'll go and look for your looks post. Looks good, you Dan. It. I'll look for it. I'm not going to lie. Did you do it all? He did the wire. So he did all the wiring. So whenever I, I'm not gonna lie, the longest part for me, like it takes me, I can take just as long wiring my car up for the first time and building the entire car itself. <laughs> um, yeah, that Kevin looks really says, good, Dan. <clears throat> yeah, Kevin says I thought those Amazon servos on. I wait. I bought those Amazon servos on my wrestler and going strong. Yeah, they're solid. Yeah. They're solid. Um, well, good. I'm glad that uh, Dan's uh, wiring is. Uh, is yeah, good. that's. I didn't know what I was clean. looking at. <laughs> the key, the key to uh, good wiring is you want enough slack where if your chassis bends, it doesn't break. Yeah, it doesn't break the wiring off. Um, but yeah, those servos aren't bad. I put a I put links in the description. If if I have a link in the description, it's hasn't failed me yet. <clears throat> so. I'll post it you can, so you can see it. What else we got on here? Oh, Andrea goes, I wish my dad was on here so he could say what he was getting me for Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Your dad's not going to tell him what you got for Christmas. Uh, oh, let's see. Go, oh, you wrote that down. I didn't write that down. I did. What did I write? Um, apparently, Melissa's making me go live on Christmas. So we're going to go on uh, Christmas. No, on Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. We're gonna, oh, that's right. That's we're going to go live on Thanksgiving, guys. Yeah. I mean, listen, we're all about family and we're grateful. and But, you know, the wind down really starts to happen. And then at 9 o'clock, we're like, well, what do we do? So I said, because we want to kick <clears throat> off the 12 days of Christmas. Yeah. 
Is that when we'll kick it off? Totally yeah. Christmas there? The next day. We need to give them enough time to get the Christmas gifts if when I find Because I've got, man, i got some cool ones. Oh, wait. Just kidding. So maybe, I don't know. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I got the new Traxxas Bigfoot. Not going to lie. That's one that's kind of sitting in my mind. Like, should I get that thing? The Bigfoot? The Traxxas Bigfoot, yeah. What does it look like? It looks like, I don't have one here behind me. It looks like Bigfoot. Man, you, have you even seen, have, have they, oh, somebody, that Bronco, was it Doug that had that paint body like the the Bronco? Um, Doug had a cool, uh, uh. Like it was a vintage, a right? A TRX4, yeah, he TR- had a cool okay. thing. Cool paint job. Those vintage paint jobs on TRX4, I like the TRX4 body, and if you paint them vintage, they look super freaking sweet. Brian, thanks a lot, bud. Thanks for the super chat. Guys, thank you, everyone, that super chat. I mean, seriously, it, it helps us. Well, and helps it makes. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to help pay for the. I mean, help it us. It'll pay for the set. I just hand him a list of the credit card and said, hey, go ahead and get all the stuff to make the set. No, but he <sighs> says, do you have a tire? <laughs> he says, real quick. could you do a tire prep video for racing? Absolutely. That's something that I've been wanting to do. And I just oh, you don't have one? Yet. No. And that's something I've. I'm going to mount like 9,000 tires tomorrow. So, yeah. Actually, you know what I'll do tomorrow? Yeah. Do tomorrow. Oh, there uh, you go. <clears throat> um, Axel that. wants to know, what beginner RC car would you suggest for $350 or less? Man, that's a, that's a big budget. Uh, Is it a big budget? Yeah, I think so. It's a big budget. For $350 or less, uh-huh. I would get... I think you can pick up the um, the Sentin. The Sentin Brushless. That one we're on 3S. Mm-hmm. I think you can pick up maybe a Slash 4-wheel drive. Um, that might be, oh, one of the best selling cars and millions of upgrades for it. Awesome car to have if it's a beginner car slash four by not slash four, four wrestler four by four VXL. That's one of their highest selling cars during Christmas time. Um, extremely versatile, fast, goes off road. That's a good one. But you have a really wide range of stuff for a beginner car for less than 350 bucks for racing though. Right. Is that what? No, he says beginner RC car. Would you suggest for 350? Oh, okay. What the hell is Super Chat? <laughs> uh, Super Chat. So basically, when you're watching on our side, we have this this uh, the uh, the live feed chat is just scrolling and like, like fast because yeah, like there's fast. a lot of y'all in here, which there's is a, pretty awesome. Yeah, I, we we love it. Um, and then a lot of times, whenever you go live, especially like when we did the podcast. You cannot watch the live feed while you're live. Yeah, like, it's, it's hard. It's, it's hard. And what happens is you start losing your train of thought. And even now, like whenever I'm talking to you guys. Yeah, you see I'll what's get, happening. I'll get sidetracked a lot. Um, and whenever you super chat, what it does is it basically pins. It's like a big, bright, hey, this guy super chatted. Yeah. And you see the question. And uh, there are some guys out there who really have legitimate questions. Yeah. And don't mind dropping a couple bucks, you know. And I mean, look, we to try to there. answer questions throughout and in between. It just highlights. V2 it. Vids. V2 Vids is on. V2 Vids is one That's... of the guys who got the LMT early. Yeah. V2 Vids, what's up, video. bud? Yeah, what's up? I'll watch your videos. You had more views than me. On- <laughs> oh, that's okay. Happy, no, sure. That's okay. <laughs> Shout out to V2 Vids. He said the LMT is sick. It is sick. Yeah. Mark was so excited. I mean, he already has ordered an one. Yes, I did. <laughs> I got I got the Grave Digger one. Did you uh, get the Son of a Grave Digger too? I pre ordered the Son of a Grave Digger. Yeah. So, now see, V2 Vids is popular. He's, people are commenting saying what's awesome. up. Awesome. Um, Kevin Talbot's commenting on my pop stuff for. We're making it, guys. We're making it. It's so exciting. Um, but yeah, that's what Super Chat is. It pops up, big window. Yeah. Let's us know, and I don't miss the I don't miss the question. So, all the LMT vids today were awesome. Yeah, they are awesome. Yeah, um, I have some more coming out. I have another one coming out tomorrow where I actually drive it. Um, I I can't beat it up though. It's just too pretty. <laughs> it's hard. It's too pretty. It is hard. Like I know that if you gave it to Ethan and just let him have control, like it would do exactly what you wish you could do. But yeah. I mean, when he said he was just going to take it to the race this weekend, which speaking of, tell us again before, because I know we've got to start wrapping it up. You're going this weekend. You'll be in... Our, Del- we'll be in Hutto, Texas. Hutto, okay. At a Thornhill Racing Circuit, mm-hmm. um, racing the RC Pro Series Finals. Um, the Finals is a pretty big race because they take the North, the North, the RC Pro Series North, RC Pro Series South, and the RC Pro Series East, and they run one finals race. So everyone in all those fi- all those series... We'll come together in Huddle tomorrow. Super excited. Uh, I did. I won last year. 
I won e buggy last year. Open e buggy last year. Um, <clears throat> so oh dang it, I I didn't do the shimmy. Thanks, Jason. You I've keep been missing my... shimmy. <laughs> Merle Sorry, even guys. got you. <laughs> Merle, it's Johnny. <laughs> he doesn't care. I can say it now. Uh, anyways, um, yeah. So I got to race. I get. I got to go in uh, driving mode tomorrow. Yeah. Um, I do want to do. I do want to do well, but I don't want to do well. Like, here's the thing. Whenever I have like really high expectations of myself, I I, I don't do very well. So I try to just go in there and just even have Evan. Fun. Yeah. Evan's winning the series for the future pros. He's won every race that he's ran. They haven't been like complete. De- like he hasn't been demolishing people. Like they were close. Like he has worked hard to get to this point. And he's like, I got to win tomorrow. I got to win. And I said, dude, yeah. don't worry about winning. Just have fun. Yeah. Um. So, yeah. How does this I'm done? Stan, what's up? Bachelor ESC. I, see? I transitioned. <laughs> uh, Hobby Wing or Castle? Um. You know what? Castle has some really good brushless systems. Yeah. Um. That are cheap right now. Um. Very affordable. I saw, I know um, Nikolai, one of the guys who's also a subscriber, he got a he got one of the castle systems. They're very affordable, solid systems. They've been doing it for a long time. I think I think a castle system's great. I don't think you can go wrong with either one. Mm-hmm. Um, but if you have to ask me right now, I've had more experience when it comes to basher stuff with castle. They're solid. Mm-hmm. So, Weapon oh. X again. So many cool toys. Uh, are they hiring where you work? <laughs> Seriously, been out of work since March. Oh man! Concert security. Oh dang! Concert security. Yeah, yeah. that's tough. That's that is tough. tough. That is super tough. Sorry, man. Yeah. Hey, uh, uh, I'm a career coach. You can uh, hit me up. <laughs> hey, no shame. <laughs> Did you pay for that plug? <laughs> um, but yeah, yeah. Q-tips last race is. Uh, Wayne was saying Q-tips last race is super close. Yeah. Um, no, no one. I'm, I don't. We're not hiring actually. Am I hiring right now? I guess I could find some good people. So people ask me all the time, and I actually will probably do a video over this, what I do. I'm a uh, software. In his daytime job. Yeah, a yes. software development manager. So I manage a bunch <clears throat> of software developers and software architects. Hey, David. Um, however, I've been a developer architect for the, the majority of my career. So now I'm just managing them. I will get my hands dirty and actually That's develop That's right, them Jordan's. Jordan's RC. Melissa's paid plenty for that plug. I sure did. <laughs> Hey, sure have. Who's, who's <laughs> on? That's messed up. Um, but yeah, yeah. It's oh, a, big and cool RC school. Should I finish the homework or live stream? You finish priorities, your homework. kid. Priorities. Finish your homework. <laughs> All right. So well, let's make sure you're smart. <laughs> Happy wife, happy life. Absolutely, of course. Oh, he learned that early too. Um, new car lease. Yep, we're back. Yeah, we are back. Yeah, and I, we're super energized. Yeah, totally. I am so. Gung-ho. You know what? That's that's the key, right? It's like to love what you do enough that when you come back from a vacation, you're still excited to show up. And and that I I mean, I was be, excited to come home. Yeah, yeah, me too. I mean, not just because so, we we're excited to be back at home, because man, it was hot as hell in that damn hotel. But uh, yeah, yes. our hotel's AC. That's the second hotel in a row we stayed in where AC sucked. Just so you guys know, I got the LMT, I opened it up, not the actual box, but I knew what it was, and then I went on vacation. So just think about that for a second. And he didn't tell me. And I have this slash ultimate. Yeah. I want to bust that open so bad. I got all the techno pieces for that. I want to work on that super bad. Um, I've got so much cool stuff to work on. And we went on vacation. It was hard, but we needed it because we you're, we you're going to be fun. busy. Yeah. Oh, we did. New yeah, Orleans was Jordan's fun. RC potato. Oh, oh, your monologue. Tell them what, tell them what, look, look what I had loaded over here. I had the, yeah, the potato. Yeah, he has the potato ready. Yeah. Um, but our, man, I hate ending the live feed. We're having so much fun. I know. It is always fun. I wish, I mean, look, I could, we could probably go longer, but I'm not going to lie. I didn't have coffee today because someone didn't let me stop and get my milk so I can have my coffee. Because let you me were, tell you, you Tony's to coffee store. is that good. Tony's coffee is that good that I no longer have to have creamer. And I used to have to have coffee with my creamer. Like, But that coffee is amazing. And I just have to have oat milk. And so... Hold on. This is a good one. Oh, Auto oh. Blog Hub says, forgetting about the price, Protec Traxxas or MIP Speed Bits. Hmm... God, that's a tough one, guys. We should have a bad conversation so, of him next summer. I would say... Ooh, John, you're on to something. Bang, bang for the buck, for sure. I would have to say Protech. 
However, all of them are good. But if without price, mm-hmm. I would say it's between MIT and Traxxas. The Traxxas bits are solid, guys. Uh, I'm not going to... And I'm not... You guys know... <laughs> Jordan's the, RC said, wow, you stumped him. <laughs> I, I was stumped. For the longest time, everyone thought I was a Traxxas. I was sponsored by Traxxas or I worked for... I, guys, I just promoted a low seat today. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, I'm buying Arma cars now. Yeah. Uh, I like Traxxas cars. Again, it's right net down the street from me, so I get the part sport. I've gone over this a million times. Yeah. A lot of my friends work there, so... Um, I'm not just saying this. The Traxxas tools are freaking awesome. I'm not joking. They're awesome. Uh, I, it's my go-to tool set right now. Yeah. So, Joel, how do I get sponsored? I'm doing a video on that soon. You're doing that this weekend, aren't you? Um, the video I'm shooting this weekend is gonna be the is gonna be the difference between a sponsored driver and a pro driver because there okay. is a difference. And I, y'all, I'm gonna ask people what they think. And you know what? I will do a. You I'm, I'm going to do a how you get sponsored. Yeah, that's a good one. <clears throat> Actually, it's going to be a series. I'm going to do like uh, becoming like becoming a sponsored RC Shimmy. driver. Oh, sorry. Thanks, Alex. Be- <laughs> be- becoming a sponsored RC driver and then like having like, like 101 and then like basically different topics because it's way more complex than just being sponsored. That's what you got to understand. Mm-hmm. Um, misconceptions. Oh, here's a teaser. Common misconception about being sponsored. Is that you save money. No, you don't save money when you're sponsored. Um, I can honestly say... <laughs> is it because you spend more money? You, okay, so <laughs> let's let's take this for example. I go buy a car. And, uh, you know, I, I get it. It's like, you know, 600 bucks. And then I get sponsored. And let's say my sponsor, like the common deal is like a 50 deal, right? So now you're paying probably, you know, three, $400 for mm-hmm. it. But now you get 50% off everything. So I'm going to buy this part and this part. Oh, I got to get some t-shirts. I got to get this. I got to get this tool set. I got to get this. I got to get all these backup parts. I got to get these upgrades. Next thing you know, you're like $1,400 in. It's not, <laughs> everyone, you, you spend way more money. Tire sponsor, another one like that. Um, and everyone goes to this. And the support is great. And you have to have a lot of tires. But when you're tire sponsored and... <laughs> <clears throat> I love this. Look, big and cool RC. I can't go. It's too late. I love this live stream too much. And then Merle goes, that's funny. It was talk to my girlfriend on the phone or hanging with y'all. I'm out here. <laughs> that's awesome. Um, but shimmy because the people want it. People want it, babe. Uh, sorry. Yeah. What do you do with your shoulders? Sorry. Man, you hurt what, what about them? No, no, oh, no, no, oh. no. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> what is all that? Um, yeah. So seriously, you get 50% off. You buy it like three times as much. So. It's a common misconception that you save money whenever yeah. <laughs> you do. You get more. You get more stuff. You do get more stuff, but you spend a lot more. And there's a. I don't want to do the whole vlog because it's. A, I think it's a great topic and it will be yeah. a fun topic. Uh, Jay Powell, thanks for the super chat. And he, wanted, shimmy, he really sir. wanted the shimmy because look, even even Big Dude said got my sh- got my singles ready. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't have your singles ready. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god jerry's on man jerry what's up bud he's the one what's who up, he's the one who beat cancer i'm gonna see him this weekend yeah awesome and they just announced they just announced that they're gonna do f1 in austin next year in 2021 and one of the one of my buddies he's now a friend i consider him a friend i talk to him all the time um chase met him through the channel yeah we're going we're going to the race we're going uh, by the way you're not invited <laughs> It's going to be a guy. It's a three day. You want to watch race for three days? No, heck no. Okay, exactly. Um, so, yeah, me and him are going to the race. We're super. We're already planning it out. It's like October 21st of next year. We're already trying to secure tickets. Um, yeah. And the reason why I brought that up is because Jerry works at RC Circuits of America. Oh, okay. Where so, is that? F1 comes to the United States one time a year, and it's in Austin, which is just, it's about 20 minutes south awesome, of the John. track that I'm coming, I'm going to tomorrow. hmm um, Jerry works for that track. He's going to go up there and say what's up. I'm uh, meeting a lot of people. I'm meeting Jason John tomorrow. Yeah. He was on the live feed last time. He hooked it up. Um, super nice guy. Um, so yeah. See, he says I'll probably work in the F1. Jerry, that would be awesome. Man, I can't wait. I love F1, guys. Yeah. <sighs> All right. So we got 215 <laughs> people still on. Yeah, you're pretty excited about it. Man, I get, I get all hyped up, guys. I I, it was energized. a shimmy. It was Ricardo says, what's up? Love the vids. Thank you for being here, Ricardo. Jordan's RC. My birthday is October 18th. Happy belated birthday. I think I know where I'm turning 42 now. 
Hope to see you there. Awesome. Oh, that would be awesome, dude. Awesome. Yeah, that, that would, would be, be awesome. Oh, Axel, my mom said I have to go. Oh, bye, but it's my bedtime. <laughs> Thank you for being here. Good night. It's kind of my bedtime. I, I have your even, bedtime, my bedtime. You're having coffee. At least you've got something that's... I haven't even packed for the race yet tomorrow. Do you ever dirt you oval? No. That's... uh, We, we kind yeah, of hit we that topic up yeah, already. Right. Bye, um, Axel. Thank you. Later, Axel. Um, yeah, we hit that topic already. Yeah, should James, we? James, just recently subscribed to your channel. Enjoy all the, all that you do. Thanks for the info that you put out there. Been racing since I was 18 when I was first in the army. Thank you for your service. Now I'm, 15, I'm 51 anymore, now. Don't race anymore. Just play. That's yeah, still that's fun. Awesome. Yeah, that's still um, fun. I will be the first one to admit that I enjoy playing with RC cars yeah. just as much as I enjoy racing. But you actually love the races because it's like that social aspect. It is. And yeah. it's like um it's like a it's like a family. It really truly is like a race for <laughs> God. There. Oh there wait. There you go. Oh, 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 oh yeah. Oh, I got a cramp in my leg when I did that one. Jeez. <laughs> Put your ones away. I'm not open. He said he got the singles ready. Jeez. Um Facebook group approval please. Yes. Melissa. Awesome. I'll be on it. I well, just don't want to be rude and be on my phone while I'm on When here. we first started that Facebook group, I wanted to go, uh, God, people are going to make me show me my, my boobs off. <laughs> so, this is Joel goes, topic, but I'm thinking building an ar- Yes. Yes. Do it. Okay. Hold on. Wait. Okay. I, I didn't tell okay. you this yet. I didn't right. tell you this yet. We're probably going to get a pool, right? No, not probably. We are getting a pool. Yes. Freaking Dan, dyslexic dog. He knew his, what he was doing. He knew what he was doing. <laughs> um, we're probably going to get a pool. Yes. And I think I'm going to do the other half of the backyard turf. I'm okay with that. Then I would have a turf track. I'm okay with that. In my backyard. I'm what completely do you think? okay with that. So, yes, you should totally build. I don't know. So, the thing is, I wouldn't know build an off-road track. is kind of tough, like with the dirt and stuff, because if it rains, it gets blown out, things like that. I'm a, I'm the kind of I don't even mow my own grass. Yeah, curious, Joel. Are you doing indoor, outdoor? What are you thinking? I'm curious, right? Yeah, everyone's like, we're at, we'll be there. Yeah, <laughs> we're on our way. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, w- I want to build a turf track in my backyard. Yeah, yeah. Bad. Yeah. Well, I mean, we want to pull more. I want to pull more. <sighs> yeah, we're water have to crossing pull. across the pool mark. Yep. Oh, yeah. So V2 vids, that's one of the videos that I, I can't, like, I don't know if I can compete with it. Yeah, you he can. Went Let took, Ethan drive it. He took a, an X-Max across, like, as far as he could into the lake. Like, that just hurts my soul when I see an X-Max go underwater like that. Jason Weedle, what's up? You should you should have a meetup. For a live MSM driver's Meeting and track day race. Yeah, so we we talked sure. about that. Yeah, actually, I want to go. Jason, you have a lot. Uh, Iowa, I think, is where Jason's from. Uh-huh. Um, there's, I have a lot of followers in Iowa. I would love to go to Iowa. I wonder what the Romania. tracks look like out there too. Um, John Sharpie, I think he's also he up is. there. Yeah. Um, yeah, I would love to go up there. Yeah, I think that would be awesome. I need to I need to build that up, like my schedule. I mean, yeah, you know, it's just so hard with you know. What we don't really want to put too much name on it, but with what's going on, we just don't know like what the yeah, travel is going to be yeah, like. like. We do. We are both very social people, um, and yeah, we've talked so much about already what we want to do and how we want to gather and, um, and travel and go to different tracks and meet a lot <coughs> of you guys because we do. We love seeing y'all here, but I just feel like there's a different element in person. And yep. So Joel said, "My mark your kids are going pro someday." It's hard with the kids. Like, I know. I want to push them to like be faster, but yeah. the more you know how it is when you're a kid and you get pushed. You What's that, wanna, Brian? You don't want to do it anymore. So it's hard. Yeah, and we just kind of let them want to race. Yeah, right? I, I don't like, force any of them to yeah. go race. Like Evan wanted to go race. Yeah. this weekend, uh, Ethan wanted to go, but he went Wednesday. So I don't want to just like he doesn't go all the time, right? So we kind of alternate, and they're at that age where they kind of they kind of butt heads a little bit. Yeah. So we got to separate them. Um, but I don't force any of my kids to race. Yeah. They have all the cool stuff that they can race with. I mean, let's be fair, though. Evan's first word was cars. Yeah. Evan likes to race. Yeah. Evan Evan loves it. Evan. All right. Uh, let's see. So we got Jordan's RC. Come crawl with us race. in Oregon. Yes. I've been trying to get Mark and to come. Um, we have snow, beach, and sand dunes. Where can I get those awesome t-shirts? I have a beach front house insane. in Rockway. Dang. Uh, We're merch- going to go stay with Jordan. <laughs> Mer- merch at msmvlog.com. There's a this, there's a link in my descriptions. 
Um, yeah, you can order the shirts. The reason why I want to eat, so actually Melissa is setting up the store. Yeah, the online um, store. The online mm-hmm. store, and we'll have some stuff there. Um, but yeah, right now the way we're doing it that way where you have to send an email because I want to make sure I have the sizes before mm-hmm. everything. Um, but it's been working so far, and I've got my system down. I'm, yeah. I'm getting 5XL shirts, I promise. Um, I will be doing giveaways where I would like to see people with shirts. I got, man, I got the perfect picture for it. Yeah, yeah, Big Bird. I, you know, I, I did. I messaged our shirt lady this morning. Um, definitely trying to get those sizes. But, oh, uh, Jordan's RC. My daughter Elena says hi. She's oh, like, tell her I said hi. That's awesome. Uh, Roadrunner Mike. Hey, Mike. Hey, Mark. Hey, Mark. Yeah, that's my name. That's <laughs> can, your husband's can, name. Can you do a no prep drag build? Have you done that? Is that a no prep drag? Stop for the spoiler alert. Oh, jeez. That is not, that is a drag car, uh, but I'm going to build one. And I'm going to team up with uh, ProLine to build one. Mm-hmm. Which, speaking of, I save money if you use ProLine, if you go to ProLine. Uh, That's account. awesome, Brian. Um, he says, I things. wear my MSM shirt to my bowling match. <laughs> Sorry, were you talking? <laughs> to your bowling matches? That's awesome. That is awesome. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think it's like I think it's cool. Like I want the I want the MSM shirts to be kind of the sh- sh- shirts. I want the MSM shirts <laughs> to be kind of like a uh, kind of like a statement that you're you know you're you're wanting to to learn more about the hobby and then that you're part of that family, right? Yeah. So I would like if it's a way like it would be nice if someone else saw an MSM shirt and they said, "Hey, you watch Mark Santa Maria too," and then they can converse. And it brings the community closer together. Yeah. Me, for sure. If I see you with an MSM shirt at a big race, I'm going up to you and, hey, come over here, hang out with us, blah, blah. Uh, I want it to be a big group community. I think it's yeah, awesome. Yeah, I agree. I agree. That's why I was like, yes, I'm in this. Like, you know, I'm running my own business and doing my own thing, but I'm in this. Like, I want to be a part of this because it is. It's great. And I love seeing especially the Facebook group. But... Someone said, Mark, you need a medal or something for working as hard as you do. Guys. I, yeah, I, he does. I, he I works work a hard, lot. but it's. But he but loves it. So much fun. Yeah, he loves it. So like, much fun. I've talked to him. Like, do you think you can have someone edit your videos? And he's like, I can't. You know, he I just can't he edit. can't. I yeah. can't. I have to edit myself. Yeah. And I, I don't do a great job. Um, and if you haven't t- caught on already, like my thing is, I'm not trying to make these beautiful cinematography yeah. like masterpieces. That's not what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to get the point across. I'm trying to make it entertaining. Yeah, that's awesome, um, Tristan. But yeah, I have I have a lot of fun doing it. I, what's funny is I watched one of my old videos the other day. Man, go watch some of my old videos. Yeah, it's it's like we're like I'm like monotone. Not <laughs> Welcome back, family. Adam. <laughs> He's Golly, like, it says I would buy an MSM shirt. That <laughs> like shimmy. actually, should. I should make an MSM shirt that says hashtag shimmy. Yep, we got it. Thank you, J Powell. Yeah, what we'll about send you what, what is this? What's this one? Whoa, whoa, that's, that's the wave. <laughs> whoa. That's the wave. All right. Um, oh, Shay, good night. Thanks for everything you do. Thank you we're for gonna being go, here. We're going to go. We've almost been an hour and 30 minutes. Oh, we're off gonna, topic. Beef or, bar, or pork barbecue? Um, pork, for sure. Actually, I take it back. We I went, don't eat we're go, We went to potato mode, guys. We are in full potato mode. I'm a vegetarian. Mark is a complete meat eater. So. Um, All right. Let's I like, do this. So, Pork barbecue, but I have. If you've ever had a beef rib, beef ribs that are like ribs, I'm sh- trying to show you guys that I'm in a potato. Um, you ever have beef rib? It's like a gigantic rib. That's what I like. All right, so we are in potato mode. I want to mm-hmm. say thank you for everyone for the support. Um, uh, that, I'm not like I said, it's not really work when I'm having as much fun as I'm doing. Yeah, um, I agree. I, I am working hard on my real job right now. Mm-hmm. Um, we're just so busy. Monday through Friday. Yeah, that's daytime. my... Daytime, uh, yeah. Actually, and I work late. Yeah. Before I got on here, I was working late, trying to answer emails, stuff mm-hmm. like that. But other than that, this stuff, this RC stuff that I'm doing, it's not work for me. It's so much fun. John Devlin says, I'm done. I'm in tears. Let's see. <laughs> I can't shimmy. Look, what's this? Let me see what happens when you shimmy. Nothing. You just go back and forth. And listen... Listen, there were so many good questions. There were so many questions that we could not get to. So many comments. Please join the <laughs> Facebook group and ask because that's really where if you can't catch us, you know, hopefully, you know, there's other people in the group that will definitely help. And I'm trying to be serious and Mark's trying to potato time over here. So <laughs> I will let him do his little monologue no, you're doing as good. we 
Go wrap join, it up. Go join the Facebook group. Please, yeah, um, join the Facebook group. It's a great, great group. Membership uh, pending. Gotcha, big dude. I'll get you. Great group out there. Yeah. Um, other than that, um, go if you want to. Would love for you to be a Patreon. That would be nice. Yeah, I, I think I, Patreon I would... gives you just more of the one on one. So like the Facebook group, it's a community, and so is Patreon. However, it's more intimate. I, I get a lot. Can yeah, I say it is. That? It is. Like, no, yeah. I get a lot of questions. Yeah, and people just shoot me questions all day on there. Like, hey, well, Danny, I've been here. I can't what do, accept you. What do you What do you think about this? Yeah. What do you think about that? Um, what should I get for Christmas? What should I, like those kind of questions? Mm-hmm. I'll shoot you straight all day. Um, it's also because it's private. I yeah. can leak information. I'm not supposed to leak information, but I've right. been known to leak information on my page, <laughs> and uh, you guys see everything that I'm doing before I do it. <laughs> The, so everyone knew about, on Patreon, everyone knew, they didn't know what the car was. Right. But they knew that I was going to be releasing car Thursday, like Monday. Yeah. So um, there's a lot of, there's a lot of stuff. Mel's day job, Melissa has a, she owns her own business. Yeah. She's a coach. Yeah, I'm a coach. Um, She's coach. I'm a mindset coach. I'm like her biggest client right now. <laughs> he really is, guys. I'm working <laughs> on him hard. <laughs> um, But yes, guys, thank you so much for all Thanks, the support. Thanks, Merle. Um, yeah, no, thank you, everyone. Um. Congrats to all the the Patreons who won. Yeah, that was exciting. Jason, we don't want Jason sends me pictures of him on the podium. If I can get some MSN pictures of podium, I want to do like a. Oh, MSN we're gonna podium do a podium collage. on Monday. Yeah. So anyone who's racing this weekend, make sure to snap pictures. We're inside the Facebook group. We'll post <clears> on Monday <throat> podium Monday. So we want those pictures. So please, please, definitely take those pictures over the weekend. Um, yes, absolutely. If you get on the podium, let me know. Yeah. Um, send me the picture. That's great. Um, yeah, thanks for everything, guys. Yeah. It, this is this is awesome. I probably won't go live. Actually, what? Is the next time we go live on Thanksgiving? No. I just, I was kidding. It's this next Thursday. The 19th. No, we're not going live next weekend. Guys, I'll get him here. Don't worry. No, we're going live every two weeks. Okay. Uh, when will the MSM start sponsoring? Hey, races? that is another thing we have talked about. Guys, I do want to start sponsoring. Right we've now. got big, big dreams, big goals for this. We are, I mean, he's already been started. I'm just getting started. So, but you know what? Stay I tuned. I want to sponsor. If I sponsor racers, I don't want to sponsor the guy. I'll, I'll probably sponsor one of the guys that gets on the podium, like in the pro class all the time. But I would like to sponsor a sportsman driver that gets yeah. on the podium. To me, that's the most. That is the most valuable dri- the most valuable drivers at these races are the sportsman drivers. Yeah. Y'all should all be treated like kings and if y'all aren't it's messed up. And queens because there's and a queens. few That's female. Right. There's I, I don't I've race. had some I I've, I've had some females buying shirts. There we go. I've got female patreons. Yeah. All super nice. Yeah. Um I don't know if they're buying shirts for their husbands or not but Yeah. They make good Christmas gifts. And they're all individually wrapped. They're super. Yeah. They're, I think they're super cool. Yeah. Uh, my kids keep taking them. Anyways. <laughs> sponsor well, kids you. under 16. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Good night, guys. Thanks for everything. And you guys will see us in two weeks unless Melissa convinced me otherwise. Uh, I'll see you later, guys. Bye, guys.